We'll start with a Caesar salad and figure the rest out later. All right. Very good, Doctor. Well, I'm certainly glad you suggested coming out to dinner tonight. And to Dino's, one of my favorite restaurants of all time. You don't have to put an act on for me. Moi, putting on an act. Yes, I think you are. You're trying so hard to be so very brave. And if you just wouldn't try quite so hard, I think you might be able to relax. I guess I am trying too hard, huh? Just a little. The only problem is I don't know how hard to try not to try so hard, which gets a little complicated. Oh, in a way, uncomplicated. Mark. Yes, Doctor. What did we say? 1974, please. Coming right up, Doctor. Hey, my mind, fancy, fancy. Well, that is part of my plan. Oh, there's a plan afoot, is there? Oh, yes, there's a plan. You are with me tonight. I don't want you thinking about anyone else or anyone else's problems. You belong to me. Your heart, your thoughts, and your soul. That is really a good wine. Mm. You were absolutely right about it because it did help me to relax. <laughs> and you were absolutely right about coming out to dinner. I don't know when I have felt so relaxed. And I tell you a little secret. Well, why don't you tell me a big secret? I'm also just the time I sit with you. Are you fine? Yes, I'm fine. I'm just a little bit busy. Actually, that's not true. Huh? Actually, I'm all not busy. <laughs> All right, I tell you what, we're headed home. No, and, no, yes, we're going to no. have a pot of very hot, strong no. tea. Mark, oh, I have to check this. I don't want to spoil our whole evening. You better spoil the thing. But we haven't finished. That, darling. Rick. Very, very. Oh, Rick. Rick. What? 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 Come on. I don't want to go spoil our. You oh, haven't spoiled it. Oh. I haven't. You I'm haven't sorry. spoiled I'm anything. So sorry. Please. In fact, you have just made the evening almost perfect. I have. Yes, because you've been smiling for the last time. Oh. I do that real cute, don't I? I wonder if you're top ten <laughs> smiling. Well, <laughs> well <laughs> good night. This way. This way. This way. This way. How do you feel? Is that a doctor's question or a husband's question? Well, in my case, I think I'm entitled to both. Oh, okay, fine. Then I'll answer both. The patient is stable. The fresh air helped a lot. The wife is so embarrassed, and I kind of, you know, what she did just for the evening. You could not be any more in error, my dear. But you're not angry with me? Because you had something to drink? No, of course not. And the last glass of wine has given you the most beautiful, warm glow. Oh. Hmm. Well, that's not all it's given me. Would you like to hear what I would like to do right now? I don't think I dare even try to guess, do I? Okay, fine. I will show you. Mm -hmm. Pardon me. Mm -hmm. Yes. Step aside. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? Not very far. <sighs> I do declare, Rhett, darling, I'm just amazed to find that my dance card is empty for this day. Then, Miss Scarlett, please, it shall be my honor to dance with you. Thank you, darling. <sighs> Leslie, mm. I remember to tell you tonight that I, I love you. Yeah, I love you, too. And you know what love includes, of course. No. Tell me. Well, it includes such things as going through things together. Both the good things and the bad. Together? Yes, and two people can get through just about anything when they're in love. Oh, Lord, I hope so. Oh, I know so. You know why? No, why? Because we are very fortunate in that we have each other. Oh, wait, 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 
wait, wait, wait, wait, wait. You're wait. right. Uh, hey. Well, I really hate to admit this. I think I'm dizzy again. I'm so sorry. You do not have to be sorry. You oh, are boy. going upstairs. You can take your shoes off, lie down in bed. And take some nice, deep, relaxing breaths, okay? Will you come up? Of course, I'll be up in just a minute. You promise? I promised a lot to you a long time ago. You real mixed there? I think so. Sure. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, uh, yes, I guess I am. John, good to see you. How you doing? Hi. Good night. Good night. Well, he didn't, uh, waste much time on conversation, did he? I wouldn't take it personally if I were you. Everybody's been acting a little strange around here lately. Lately? Well, it's been very hard for all of us since Lord. Yeah, I know. You know something? Your old man is, he's one great guy. I know. And I'm convinced that Leslie is probably the most wonderful woman in the world. I don't think I could love either of them more if they were my natural parents. You know, I, I know they aren't, but uh, I never think of them that way. Neither do we. Hey, I had, uh, I had a great time tonight. So did I. Honest? <laughs> Was it as good as um, any other dates you've had? My other dates. <laughs> well, to tell you the truth, um, I really don't have that many dates. Oh, come on, I mean, no, come on, no, you're really, putting really, me on. No, really, wait a second. I mostly just go out with groups of people, you know, friends like Brian and Claudia. And I don't go out on very many date dates, uh, you know? That's really hard to believe. You're really pretty, Amy. I think that guys would be flocking around here like uh, kids at a candy store. <laughs> you really are pretty, Amy. You know, you don't have to say that. You really don't. I want to say it. You know why? Because you are. It's the truth. You really are pretty. I think you're beautiful. Oh, Rick. Hi. Uh, <clears throat> I was just getting ready to go. Well, don't don't leave on account of me. I just don't want to get less of some tea. No, no, no. I, I, I better get going now anyway. Yeah, you know, I'm in training, and Packy, uh, he's a real bear about me getting eight hours sleep. Great. Um, can I get less sleep that tea? Oh, thanks, Amy. I'll do it myself. I'd really like to. Okay. Be my guest. Okay. Um, I really had a very nice time tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Does that mean we can do it again? Yeah, we can. Great, great. Oh, I'm gonna go get the tea. See ya. Bye. Thanks, Amy. Oh, oh Rick, uh, before I leave, uh, can I talk to you about something? Sure, John. What's on your mind? Well, I noticed that Leslie wasn't exactly, you know, overwhelmed uh, with joy that I was mentioning I might fight pro again. Does this mean you guys are really against the idea? Oh, no, neither one of us is against you fighting again. John, I think you just maybe misinterpreted our reactions. Oh, well, what do you mean? Leslie is uh, very much a, a worrier. And when she cares about someone, really cares about them, she just you know, doesn't want to see them get hurt. I think that's all there was to it. Oh, that's a relief. Because I really am serious, you know. I really want to fight pro again. Well, then you'll find the two of us are behind you 100%. Mm -hmm. Okay? Hey, okay. Right. I get you, Jack. Oh, man. Okay. Except for feeling a little bit foolish, I'm just fine. Leslie, it was a great evening. It was not exactly the way I had it planned. But it was very good for us. Yeah, it was. And you were right. What? With all of that, I did forget for a little while. Great. I did. Okay. Oh, no! What? What? Oh, Lord, speaking of forgetting, what about Mike? Mike is fine. He's spending the night at Packy's, and Packy was glad to have him. Oh, goodness. He must be in seventh heaven. As far as he's concerned, Packy is the greatest thing since bubblegum. Oh, no. What? No. Packy doesn't know anything about getting to Mike. 
to school in the morning, yes, Rick. He does. He knows what time. He knows what place. It's all been taken care of. Now, are there any other problems that I have already solved for you? Hmm? I can't think of any. Sorry. That's all right. I'm coming to bed. Yeah, I've got a very early day tomorrow. You do? Do you have surgery? No, but I've got to be at court. I promised Joe I'd, I'd go with him on spine. Oh, yeah, right. What do you think's going to happen with all that? Well, Spike's guilty. He took the money. Of course, we got yeah. half of it back, and we got some merchandise from the other portion of it. Uh-huh. The judge just may set up a rehabilitation program. Same judge that helped us with the adoption of Mike. Oh, yeah? She's very advanced in her thinking. Mm -hmm. Looks good for it. Of course, he is guilty. He has to pay him some way for what he did. 